you're scoring it wrong. 16 is a 54. Aggie. This is Beauty. Excuse me. This is Bo. This is Hannah. And as soon as the dog. Oh, I'm so awkward. This is Echo. The previous dog was Boom. This is Nick. This is Pilot. This is Flip. This is Zoe. This is Hannah. This is Keen. This is Diva. This is this is Cassie. This is Traveler. I'm no dog. This is Isis. This is Tezza. This is Point. This is Alex. I hope he's got this. This is Stat. This is Keegan. This is Dandy. This is Gusto. This is Dicey. This is Bob. This is Bristol. This is Royce. This is Catchers. This is Strider. This is Coco. Thank you. Kestrel. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so I've been doing this with hand weights. First you have to know how much the tire weighs. The Smith tire is very lightweight. It weighs 2 pounds. 
Now if you turn the tire and hold it this way, so the bottom of the tire is now over here, uh, you're going to be asking the magnets to hold whatever half this tire weight is, plus any weights I'm going to be adding right here. Okay. So here you can hold, as you can see, we're going to add, this is a 10 pound weight, this is a 15 pound weight, and I'm going to add one pound of pennies, okay. so that's 16 pounds plus one half of this tire weight, or one pound, so that's 17 pounds that I'm asking this tire to hold now as I lift it. Okay, now here's the problem with the hand weight thing. You do have to balance it. Let's try it again. All right, so here we're showing that this tire is holding 17 pounds. Okay. Now these magnets, these are the magnets in the tire used at the TNT Canines test. So we rated it. 18 pounds pull force. What I'm doing now is there's the 10 pound weight, 5 pound weight, 2 pound weight, so that's 17 pounds plus the pound of tire weight that I'm asking it to hold up means that I now break at 18 pounds. Besides the inconvenience of needing to lug hand weights around, this method is prone to error. If you lift the tire too quickly, you've added the force of acceleration to it, so the tire is going to appear to open at a lesser pull force. Okay, so uh, if we go back to the 716 pounds of hand weights plus one pound of tire for a total of 17 pounds, before we could see that the tire held that pretty accurately, if I lift it too quickly, we fail. Okay. However, Again, if I lift it nice and slowly, so I've not added that force of acceleration, you can see it holds 17 pounds.